Well, it's another lovely spring day here in Central Oregon. Um, let's see, yesterday it was 61 degrees, and today it is, I think, 40s is the high, and it's raining. So, we have to keep working. And people always ask, well, can you even clean windows in the rain? And the answer is yes. Um, especially because of the cleaning methods that we choose to use uh, for exterior cleanings. Um, we're actually going to leave the windows cleaner than with traditional squeegee. Plus, the way we do the work is impervious to uh, normal rain. Um, our client here, um, actually, let's take a look at this. They normally have this amazing view of the sisters out this over this uh, field, but uh, because of that amazing view, they always want to have their windows clean. So we're regularly here, and despite it being rainy today, uh, we're going to go ahead and give them a clean using our water, pure water system. Um, in the industry, we call this a water-fed uh, pole or with a water-fed brush. And you see the water just streams out of here, and we can brush the window clean using this water. And actually, as you can see, the effect of these multiple jets of water is that it creates a solid sheet of water to rinse all the debris that we loosen up with the brush off. Now, we don't use this method just on rainy days. In fact, it works uh, all the time. And the reason it works is because of the filtration system that we use. Our filtration system takes standard tap water and it takes all the minerals out of it. What that means is that the water that comes out of that brush can't leave spots. It's pure water. Um, in fact, here, let's just show this. I'm going to walk over to the spigot here. And here at this house, they have fairly soft water. Um, it's got 65 mineral um, bits or mineral molecules for every million molecules of water. So we're going to take this Let's let it run a little bit so we get all the debris from the uh, system out. And we'll fill that little cap up. Oops. You can see here, the water at this house registers at 69 or 70 parts per million. Uh, with the mineral content that we typically have in Central Oregon, that's enough to, uh, well, leave water spots on the glass for sure. And those water spots are actually going to be so hard that they won't come off with just regular cleaning. It's the reason why in your shower, if you're letting the water sit on the glass and you get those spots on there, they don't come off when you scrub. Um, if it was just soap residue, obviously that would come off because it's just scrubbing soap off. But we're going to take a little bit of the water that's trickling out of this brush, fill up this cap again. Let me set this down here. And... The device is ready to go and we will test this water and let's see our purification system okay so there is one maybe two molecules left actually that's probably just leftovers from um, the original tap let's do this one more time make sure we get a good rinse out of there we'll rinse the device off as well Yeah, so the actual water coming out of that brush has no minerals left in it. At least that not for every million molecules of water, there's not even one uh, molecule of mineral in that water. So this water won't leave spots. The other thing is because we're using pure water and no soap, there's no soap residue left behind because when you squeegee, let me shut the water off here real quick. When you squeegee off soapy water, there's a tiny microscopic layer of soap that gets left behind. And that layer of soap can actually attract dirt. Uh, when the wind blows, when the pollen season comes, it's gonna stick to that little thin soap residue layer on the glass and actually make the windows look dirtier sooner. But because there's nothing left on the glass, even if a little bit of wind does blow, the dust really has nothing to stick to and it blows right off. And then if rain comes along, and hits the windows, it 
is pure water. It's uh, just as pure as the water that we're washing the windows with now. And so that rainwater is not going to leave any dirt on the windows. Now, the reason people always see dirt on the windows, or they say that the rain makes their windows dirty, is because they see the rain hitting dirty windows. And when that happens, it's going to leave clean streaks in the middle of all that dirt. So you're actually seeing the rain partially or slightly clean the window. And the way it congeals, moves the dirt around, it usually looks worse than that even layer of dirt that coats the whole pane of glass normally. So we can confidently say that rain's not going to make your windows dirty and cleaning windows in the rain are gonna, is going to leave you with perfect results. Now if we've got driving rains and it's you know, running all down the house, pulling dirt off the siding, and then running down the windows, that might be an issue. And of course, in a condition like that, we're not gonna to wanna to be outside cleaning anyway, so we'll probably reschedule. But we just wanna know that our clients can always be confident that you can continue to get your, rain, your windows washed even if it's rainy, and you're still gonna have perfect results. And even if you don't, our deluxe and premium window cleaning we still give you a guarantee. We have, uh, in fact, uh, it starts with a seven-day rain guarantee so that uh, within seven days afterwards, if we get a rainstorm, 